All right, guys, this weekend's workout is the kettlebell killer, okay? So, yes, I come up with cheesy workout names. Get over it. Okay, so, even though I'm calling it the kettlebell killer, you can use a single dumbbell if you don't have kettlebells. And I know not everybody has a kettlebell at home, but for everybody that does, here's a workout you can do. Um, if you just have dumbbells, I'll show you that. I just didn't have a cheesy name for it. So... I stick with kettlebell killer. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to do each exercise. Okay, I want to either go through every exercise and then come back to it, or I'm going to do um, three to five sets of each exercise. So either do all five exercises, go do the first one, second one, third one, fourth one, fifth one, and then go all the way back three to five times, or do three to five sets with a short break in between. So however you want to choose to do it. But do 20 reps per exercise. So basically you're doing 60 to 100 reps of each. Okay. First one is going to be good old fashioned kettlebell swings. Second one are goblet squats where I'm holding the kettlebell up at my chest. Okay. Deadlifts. And I'm going to kind of show you how you can work it uh, using the kettlebell or dumbbell. And I'll, I'll even, um, in the video, I'll even show a single, dead, single leg deadlift, a way to do a single leg de deadlift, figure eight lunges. So to show that, I'm going to be doing figure eights as I'm lunging. Okay, and that's total reps, but what I would recommend is at 10, switch the direction you're spinning it, just to kind of trick the muscles a little bit, because your body will kind of adjust to the movement, as well as it will work your shoulders and your torso a bit. Okay. And then the last one, you're going to drop the weight, and you're going to drop down to 90 degrees, and you're just going to hold, hold that squat position, okay? So, again, three to five sets of swings, goblet squats, deadlifts, figure eight lunges, and holding at 90 degrees, okay? 20 reps per exercise. Let's get it. All right, guys, so swings, I'm here, okay? Taking the kettlebell, coming in, Popping up with my head. Okay. Make sure you're not using your shoulders. Okay. And you could go here. I don't do that much. I don't care for it. But I'm making sure I'm pushing with my hips, squeezing with my glutes. Okay. With the single dumbbell, a couple different ways. Instead of holding it like this, okay, it's not a shake weight. I'm gonna hold it here. Right? And then I'm gonna swing. Just making sure I have a good grip. So seeing here, got it in my hand, I swing. Making sure I'm using my hips. Okay. Goblet squats. Here, I like to hold the kettlebell here. Okay? You can hold it here if you'd like to. Okay, I just I don't know, for me, this is the most comfortable. Okay, I'm here, and then same thing with the squat. So I'm going to sit back, my weight's on my heels, squat nice and low, okay? I want to make sure I don't lean forward with the weight, okay? So holding here even, squat in there. Now, with the dumbbell, a couple options. I can hold here and do it, or here and do it. Okay, now the deadlifts. So, the lift doesn't really start until I'm on the ground. Okay, I'm gonna have the kettlebell here. I'm gonna make sure I sit back and I drop nice and low to reach. I'm gonna make sure it's kinda right at my toes. Here, I'm gonna drive up with my hips. Here, okay. You can't really see in the video, but I'm actually curling my toes up. So I'm driving through my heels my back, my legs, and my butt, okay? So I'm here. One common mistake is a lot of people go here and just lift with their back and then really shove their hips forward, All right? I'm just here, lift, go down, explode up, go down, explode up, okay? With the dumbbell, hold it kind of here. Now, you won't go as low as you would with a lot of kettlebells, but you can still get a lot of work from it. So drop it nice and low, lift up, low, 
lift up. Again, making sure my back stays straight. I'm not coming here. If you want to challenge your depth a little bit, okay, I'm going to come here. And then same thing, drop in as low as I can, driving up. Remember, the focus is the drive up, the pull up, not necessarily the drop down. Here, up. Okay? Now, if I'm going to do a single leg deadlift, all right? So there's a couple different ways I can put my foot. Um, if you have something to put on, you can do that. Otherwise, I just want to make sure my weight is on my front leg, just as if I was standing square. Okay? So I'm going to be here. I can hold it one side, on that side if you want, okay? Or this side, but I'm going to hold it. I actually will use both hands, and I'm going to dip down just like a deadlift. So you can even start with it on the ground. All right? Dip, lift, making sure I'm focused on that front leg. My back leg is just controlling. Okay? So I put it down, I lift, boom. Now, I'm not doing here, right? I'm not doing straight leg, okay? I'm keeping it bent. I'm purposely bending my knee so that I mimic a normal, right, a normal deadlift. So I'm here, I go down, boom. If you want to use two hands, you can. If you want to use one, you can. And then up, right? Down, my weight's on my front leg, up. Okay, same with the other leg, so you can see it from this angle. Okay, so I'm going to start the kettlebell on the ground. My weight's on my front leg. Okay, this one, this is just for balance, right? I'm not trying to do a lunge. That's next. So I'm here, here, chest is up strong, lift. Okay, Ooh, that's why we use that back leg. Here, boom. Okay, now, figure eight lunges. So that you can kind of see from here. So when I step to do my lunge, I'm gonna bend my knee under. Step, under. Right, making sure I get a good lunge. There, after halfway, switch it. Boom. So now, instead of going this way to go under my leg, I'm going this way. Okay. Then after that, oops, sorry, with single dumbbell. Okay, it's going to be a little bit trickier, but you can do it. So, kind of hold it on the end and pass it that way. Okay, and then switch directions, right? So this way. Oh. Oh. Okay. And then after that. Just gonna drop down to 90 and hold. Enjoy.